This video is about congruent triangles. The four triangles on this page are all congruent. But what does that mean? Well, what it means is that they are identical in all respects. I can show you these four triangles are identical. How can I do that? Well, one way I could trace this one, and then I could show that it fits exactly over the other shapes on the page. So let's do that. This is a tracing of this one. If we translate this one up to the top one, with a little bit of margin for error, you can see that those triangles are pretty much identical. In other words, they're congruent. What about comparing this one with this one? A little bit harder, but if we rotate this one, and then translate it, We can see, perhaps with a little bit of rotation again, that those two are identical. In the bottom one, a little bit harder, we've got to do something else before we can show that they're the same shape. They don't seem to be the same shape. However, if we reflect this one in an imaginary y-axis, and then work with that shape, if we rotate it, and translate it, rotate it a bit more, and translate it. We can see that in fact those shapes are also identical. So the four shapes we started with are all identical or they're congruent. Now if they're congruent, it means a couple of things. One, they have three pairs of corresponding sides equal. For example, comparing this one and this one, single hash, single hash, double hash, double hash, triple hash, triple hash. Three pairs of corresponding angles equal. Not only that, the corresponding angles are equal. For example, the angle marked here between, with the square between the single hash and the double hash has a corresponding angle the same size between the single hash and the double hash in this triangle. The angle between the single hash and the triple hash line, marked with a circle, is identical or the same as the angle between the single hash and the triple hash in this triangle. In other words, those corresponding angles are equal. And lastly, the angles marked with the star between the double hash and the triple hash are equal. So they have three pairs of corresponding angles equal. Now let's look at these triangles. Which of them is congruent or identical to ABC. Well, if you compare ABC with PQR, they look like they're the same shape. It looks like the angles are identical. And in fact, they are. But the corresponding sides are not equal. This side corresponds to this one, but this is larger. It seems like the whole triangle is a slight enlargement of this one. So the angles are the same, but the sides, corresponding sides are not the same. So those two are not congruent. Comparing this one with this one, well, if you look at the angles, this triangle has an angle of nearly 90, a bit less than 90. There's no, tri no angle in this triangle which is close to 90, so those two cannot be congruent. It must be these two which are congruent. Again, a little bit hard to show it, but if we rotate it and translate it, rotate it and translate it, we can see that they are in fact identical. In other words, they're congruent. It was the first triangle, which was ABC, or BCA. It is congru congruent to triangle MNL.